Here's what those who have looked at all the data say about the future. Climate change, energy security, and economic stability are inextricably linked. Climate change will contribute to food and water scarcity, will increase the spread of disease, and may spur or exacerbate mass migration. Who do you suppose said that? Not a pundit. Not a politician, the Pentagon. These war games at Fort Irwin, California provide realistic training to keep our soldiers safe. The purpose of the Pentagon's Quadrennial Defense Review, the QDR, is to keep the nation safe. The review covers military strategies for an uncertain world. The Pentagon has to think long term and be ready for all contingencies. The 2010 QDR was the first time that those contingencies included climate change. Rear Admiral David Titley is oceanographer of the Navy and contributed to the Defense Review. Well, I, I think the QDR uh, really talks about climate change uh, in terms that it really isn't uh, for debate. And, and you take a look at the global temperatures, you take a look at sea level rise, you take a look at what the glaciers are doing, not just one or two glaciers, but really glaciers uh, worldwide. And you add all of those up together. And that's one of the reasons we really believe that the, uh, the climate is changing. So the observations tell us that. Physics tells us this as well. One area of particular concern to the Navy is sea level rise. Sea level rise is going to be a, a long-term and very, very significant issue for the 21st century. The QDR included an infrastructure vulnerability assessment that found that 153 naval installations are at significant risk from climatic stresses. From Pearl Harbor, Hawaii to Norfolk, Virginia, the bases and their nearby communities will have to adapt. Even with one to two meters of sea level rise, which is very, very substantial, we have time. This, this, is, this is not a crisis, but it is certainly going to be a strategic challenge. For the Pentagon, climate change is a threat multiplier. But with sound climate science, Titley believes forewarned is forearmed. The good thing is, is the science is advanced enough in oceanography, glaciology, meteorology, that we have some skill at some time frames of predicting this. And if we choose to use those projections, we can in fact, by our behavior, alter the future in our favor. Titley and the Pentagon think the facts are in. Climate change is happening, and there is very, very strong evidence that, uh, that a large part of this is in fact man-made. 